Hey, welcome back to Class of All Nine. <laughs> Things are taking many turns for the very, very interesting in this game. We've gotten a lot of endings so far. Uh, I just want to fucking graduate. Dude, the real accurate representation of just how shitty everybody was during this time period. Being someone molded by this time period. It's fucking... And, and they get caught along with the wave. And then being able to look back on it with uh, better eyes. Who <laughs> Just... Ugh. It's like, yes. It's like a parody and everything. That, But it just... It's like a... It's like a... A, 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 a cultural caricature. Where... Everything is truthful, but everything is exaggerated. So yes, it's exaggerated, but the, the, these the uh, yeah. What what what's the warning in this game uh, about? Yeah, about this video game is entirely based on real events, encounters, and personalities. Any content viewed as offensive is a reflection of American culture and not endorsed by Class of 09 or its staff. And that is the most fucking accurate statement about this game. And American culture, North American culture, as a Canadian. North American culture around that time. Everything I'm getting here is everything I had to deal with uh, as a, a Jeffrey-style child uh, growing up at that time. This game's great. Uh, we gotta pick a pretty decent uh, continue point. Uh... Maybe, we, we, let's get a video of this shit. So, what are the orders? Do you guys do a bunch of chants or something? For sure, dude. Yeah, we could show you some if you like. Well, I was wondering if I could maybe take a video of it, just so I could review at home and practice. Oh, so you're joining? I didn't say that, but maybe this could convince me. This is gonna be good. All right, you better start rolling. Aryan Brothers Assemble! Aryan Brothers! Yeah, we're doing the chant? Hell yeah, we're doing the chant. White pride worldwide. White pride yeah, worldwide. Yeah, awesome. White You're pride doing great, worldwide. guys. So how about it, Nicole? You gonna join? I don't know. You really made a convincing argument with this. <laughs> can I take this video home and watch it a few times? <laughs> sure. I can come over and do more chants too if you'd like. Uh, no, nah, that's okay. Okay, let's see what the Nation of Islam forums have to say about this. <laughs> My okay. Chemical Romance, I see it. So, right after I uploaded that video to the NOI forums, it was immediately shared everywhere. Shared to the point of Minister Farrakhan seeing it and ordering a full-scale arson assault on the entire school. He kinda just posted that, and I'm not even sure if it was the real Farrakhan, you know, but I called in sick anyway. Sucks to be in the white pride party. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> so, it's either... Everybody in the school gets fucked up. Or, other choice, everybody in the school gets fucked up. But by... <laughs> this game is great. Okay. So, clearly, swearing at the, the teacher was a bad idea. Uh, so yeah, let's go back to... I don't know who gives a shit. I don't fucking know. Sorry, couldn't tell ya. Come on, you didn't even try. Did it have something to do with the slave sex thing he said? No, please I think it subject. might have something to do with the slave when sex. when you think about it, he's the first president to have an interracial relationship. That might make him the least racist president of all time until Obama gets elected. He literally owns slaves. Obama owns slaves? I guess we'll never have a non-racist president. Uh, no. Thomas Jefferson. Uh, yeah, I was joking. I like Karen. Thank you for derailing yet another class, You're Nicole. fucking welcome, Tell that bro. to a cross kid. He said the slave shit first. True. True. 
The call got it together. Also, you asked me. The government forces me to be here, and you expect me to try at volleyball? God damn it, our team keeps fucking losing. So fucking gay. Okay, hold on. What's your pro Hey, cut. Uh, dude, well, no, all these mech, you mean like, I call it fucking gay. Who's with me? Uh, are they, okay, this was the other thing. Because I said I like rap music, and then he went on about wiggers or whatever. So we're gonna, uh, who fucking cares, dude? Just shut up and pass the ball like <laughs> I got a fucking what? serve. How can you side with that? No one gives a shit but you and men who smoke at chain restaurant bars. Oh yeah, nothing True. matters unless you care. I see how it is. Can you just assume you won the argument so I can stop hearing this? <laughs> fucking women gotta go too, dude. I wanna move to the Middle East, a country that stones loud women to death. Sorry, what country is that? I just said, the Middle East? For such a smartass, you don't know books too good. And now we're just gonna... But that's beside the point. Just get your grades up, Nicole. Uh-huh. And... But don't... Nicole... Wow. Are you... Was it pedophilia? You didn't say no. <laughs> that... Finally... She almost got me that time. Oh, cool, you joined too? No. My... Hey! My what? Grand call... Why would I care? The only people in punk... So... Benefit... Wait. I know, but then... Well, kind of like... Uh... Well, okay. the orders are fun, so... Uh... Well, the orders are fun. So, let I guess there's Where are the menus that. even? Uh-oh. So, let me ask this. Now that you're in this club, the girl... Not really. But the guys, they... Like, for fun? M? To for menu? Or to give you Escape? pride party orders? Is there a menu in this? Uh... You know, Jeff... Kill. Okay. Hang on. Sounds like we're just gonna have to go replay the ga the whole game through again. Still, no, what the fuck? What? I know. What the fuck? It's so obvious you die it, right? Right. You better be dying that here. Uh, I think we might just have to go ahead and uh, create a new game. <laughs> okay. So, I guess we accidentally picked the white supremacist path by getting by getting us some zannies. I think we've explored every option out of Mr. White's tree. I wish there was it's it's not like Katawa Shoujo or Yume Miro Kasuri where the game's been out a while and there's a nice little dialogue tree that I can follow. No, this is natural dialogue tree progression. Uh, new game. <laughs> Make I just want to graduate, mistake. man. I just want to fucking graduate. <laughs> this game's great. God, that sounded evil. Okay. Let's rewind Skip. a little. I grew. Hey, so for the I'm out. No, 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 no. I, I could show you around, like, like a school tour. You want to do that? You up for that? Okay. I think there's one more branch. I'm gonna be off of this I, that we can go to. That was real. Uh, I'm in a bit. Doesn't pay. How well, cool. enough to demotivate an elephant? I got him right We're here. Pop the perks. With me? They only kind of. Oh. oh shit. Prescription pills? Whose are these? Actually, it doesn't matter. You're both in big trouble. No snitching this time. I think. Unless there's the go to gym thing. I think there's the wait, go to wait, gym what? thing. Okay. Oh, lunch. What? Oh, are you? Oh, you're too. Yeah, you're fine. Someone just he is Huh. This is it. So where are you headed? We went to photography. Everything went fucking shit south from there. I'm thinking it's gym class. Look, it's the first day. No funny guys. No comedians. No bringers of the ha ha. Okay. No bringers of the ha ha. This isn't last year's gym class. We're gonna really buckle down on physical. This is what every gym teacher actually said, dude. Young lady, what's your name? Nicole. You want my phone number too? <laughs> this is only the first class, Nicole. You won't be a problem all year, will you? No, sorry. Good. Now everybody better dress out every class. If you don't, it's a zero. Hit the locker rooms. I'll see you back here in ten. Guess it's uh, guess it's gym class. Where the hell did I put the shirt? Why does it even need the school? Uh oh, logo? it's getting a little risque. Having trouble. Oh, what are you the oh, fuck are you doing in here? in here? Saw you were lagging behind. I uh, thought you might need a spare shirt. Oh, thanks. Stop looking. Now, please. You know something? You're feisty. You're feisty. I like that in my female students. I got a feeling you like something else in your female students, too. See, you just snap back like that. I like it. It's sexy. 
You are saying this to a 16 year old in the girls' locker room. Come on. What's that? What, what is it? <laughs> Look at you. You're mature enough. What? Do we humor the pedophile? One of the toughest decisions we've ever had to make. Or do we scream and hurt our lungs and our voice box and talk raspy for the rest of the day? Don't think so. I think we're just going to let's I mean, let's just see what happens. I guess. Yeah. So what's up? Just wanted to chat with a pretty girl. About? Oh, I don't know. Uh, I just like looking at you. Why do girls say they like older men? You're just as boring as younger men. <laughs> I could show you a fun time a lot of these high school boys couldn't. Oh, yeah? Yeah, and I'll prove it, too. Hang up by the back end. Are we going to go to Dave and Buster's? School. I'm going to date my gym teacher. You have money to spend on me, right? Like at least a couple hundred? Oh, I got more than a couple hundred. Like three Damn, $370? Shit, I'm just a kid. That's a lot for me. Let's, Let's fucking go. Sounds like a date, sexy. Can I call you sexy? I mean, the news would call me a victim, but what do they know, right? Anyway, I'll see you tonight, man. Nicole, Nicole, could you call me? My friends coach? call me coach. <laughs> see you tonight. Uh, <laughs> David Busters. <laughs> so, uh, how was your drink so far? My non-alcoholic Sprite is just wonderful. This day kind of sucks so far. Could you get me high or something? You want a sip of my yes. screwdriver? Yes. Sure, thanks. Can I have some more? Some more? Sure. How many? How many sips would equal four glasses? Now, I can't have you stumbling out of here wasted. People would start suspecting something. I'm one third your that age. Should, that yeah, that's, yeah that's already. I know. It's such a rush. You feeling yeah? it too? Yeah? I don't know. I feel um, like I'm in danger. Sure. So can I have money? Not so fast, sexy. I was thinking you could come back to my place to collect. Go back to his place alone. I don't see the problem. <laughs> yeah, coach, I'm down. Good girl. Just so you know, you're gonna have to jumping hurry. jacks. Do whatever you want. The money outweighs the trauma. Come on, sexy. Let's get out of here. After you, coach. I'm just hoping to get 370 bucks out of this. I came to school with the full intention of fucking around. Life was hopeless, so sleeping with my gym teacher was just a drop in the bucket. You could say the major mistake was going home with a stranger, but honestly, most strangers are fine as long as they're not into necrophilia. The second I stepped in, he locked the door behind us, grabbing my neck and squeezing really fucking tight. The last thing I remember was the rush in his eyes while the life slipped from mine. I didn't know her that well, but tell Jekka she's cool for me. As for my family, they can fuck off and burn in hell with me. True. See you soon, Dad. Wait a second. So you're telling me that dating our high our gym teacher was a bad idea? You're kidding me. <laughs> what <are> the <laughs> hmm. Maybe we make a scene. Fuck yeah, I'll go home with you. You just earned an A for the year, young lady. Hey, why don't you put your hand on my thigh? Give me a preview. Okay, this is getting cool. I've got the skin on him smooth and tight. Smooth and Everything's tight. Everything's tight when you're 16. Oh, that's nice. Of all the students I've dated, you're my favorite. Ah, get your hand off my leg! Help! Stop! What the fuck are you doing, sir? Yo! What's the problem here? This is my teacher. He just Is this true, sir? No, well, well yes, but uh, they have the gym teachers do sexual education now. What's eating ass have to do with sexual education? Oh. Oh, yeah. Is that true? Did you tell her to eat your ass out? No, I wanted to eat No, about well, you fucked I it, mean, kid. Uh, Sorry, officer. That was just a false alarm. Oh, thank God. He just said he wanted to come all over me. No big deal, right, coach? What? Well, coach, the only place you're coming is down. Oh, yeah, we got him. fucking Bitch, I'll, I'll kill you and your, and your whole family too! Hey man, I got you arrested. You don't gotta do me that favor. <laughs> Woo! That was great. Well, are you gonna tell me? 
tell you what. You know what? Everyone's Everyone's talking about, talking about what happened at Dave and Buster. That's what they call those places. Men will invent any phrase to make their video games less important. I'm currently playing so one. It is true. What happened? Did Coach promise you a good grade yes. or something? First of all, how does anyone even know I was there? I didn't file any charges. Some guy who goes here snapped a picture of you at the table with him. Wow, a real vigilante. No, he just does that for his private collection of girls who go here. You getting caught with a gym teacher on camera was pure coincidence. Dork. Okay, well, I kind of baited him into harassing me. Nicole, that's fucked up. What if you get harassed for real one day and no one believes you because of that? Oh, yeah, I guess a date with your high school gym teacher was a perfectly fine situation. I'll leave it alone next time, thanks. <laughs> okay, point taken, bitch. So what, he groped you and someone saw, or...? Well, no, I told him to grope me and just screamed. Pretty great. Oh, my God. So that was premeditated on your part. Mostly. So why'd you even go out with him in the first place if you knew... Because I fucking hate show? this place. You know... Don't have a great answer for that. I just did it because I could. The more I thought about it, the more leverage I knew yep. I had. But he's twice your size. He, he did kill you. us. Yeah, but then we but rewound time. Were around. The second he decided to date a minor, he lost the game of life. Now he's in jail, lost his job, most of his friends. If he had a family, they probably bailed too. And if someone tries to put the blame on the minor, they look like a monster. Exactly. Susan B. Anthony or whoever the fuck got women this far, but I fucking got it here. pass me the fucking torch, Suze. I fucking got it, bro. Okay, we made it to stage two. So it's been a few months since we moved. How's school going? Like academically or socially? Everything. Anything. Uh, why am I off screen? Honestly, it's because there's a nugget in my nose good. and it's bothering oh, me. It's embarrassing to, to pick hear. it on camera. I know moving or blow my nose. can be hard. And if I cared, it absolutely would be. But mom, I figured out that if you just don't engage with other people's emotions or desires, nothing's a burden. great. Excuse me? Like, I'll put it like this. Anytime a guy asks for my company, asks me out, asks for anything, and I make decisions entirely for, for myself, not concerned with their feelings, there's no stress. Honey, that sounds a little mean-spirited, don't you think? Yeah, well, what's the alternative? Being used to do shit? People, especially men, are the perfect pawns when you don't give a fuck about them or whatever they want. True. Uh, I won't argue. I'll just hope you learn how to interact like a human being when you're oh a senior. Oh my god, we so actually made it. you're telling me it's it. a requirement for women to be pushovers or sociopathic? What the fuck happened to feminism, Mom? <laughs> Nicole, I don't know any woman who actively considers feminism. We vote and work. It's just a fun thing to say. <laughs> okay, well, fuck feminism. I'm starting Nicoleism. Nicoleism. Yeah, the main concept is girls removing all the emotional attachment from any. Sounds like a solid oh, idea. I'm sure you'll meet a nice boy soon, and you'll be all over this. How can I meet a nice boy when all men are just rapists and pedophiles? Is fucking kids nice, Mom? This conversation is over. She didn't say no. She didn't say no. Aw, oh, shit. And so you see... The aperture actually gets wider the With lower the f-stop gets. gets. Did I really forget my eyeliner? Ahem. Ahem. Dude, you really need that cough like that. It's kind of annoying. This isn't cosmetics class, Nicole. I know that. So pay attention to the photography lecture in photography class. I'll be done in like two seconds. Just calm down. Now, Nicole. Uh... You can't fucking tell me what to do. Now nothing. Literally, go fuck go yourself. Fuck yourself. <laughs> How dare you? How dare you disrupt my lecture? It's disrespectful to me and your classmates. You can't trick anyone here into being mad at me when no one gives a shit about your class in the first place. Well, how would you like a failing grade? How would all of you like a failing grade? I mean... I guess it's fine. It's an elective. Yeah, Mr. White, you can't keep us from graduating. You tell him, Nicole. Shut the fuck up, you finger skateboard Whoa, tech decks are cool. Dude, I was just trying yeah. to help. <laughs> yeah, you were trying something. <laughs> How would you like a visit no! to the counselor's office? The principal's office? Hey, if you think not listening to you talk is discipline, then I'm gone. No problem. <laughs> Out. <laughs> no. Owned. Fucking destroyed. God. Yeah, can we just pretend you said a lot of stuff so I can leave early? The principal ordered for you to be in this uh oh Well, I order no mayo at Dairy Queen, but you still see them slapping the shit on. Mm -hmm. And what do you mean by that? 
How are you feeling? I'm saying if a whole company like them can't get my order right, then what's one guy like you? Mistakes happen. They can try again after the next soccer <laughs> practice. I think we got a bit sidetracked here. No, not just sidetracked. I fucking derailed this shit. Talking out of turn in class, bullying classmates, talking back to faculty. Is this really the legacy you want to leave? Yes. It's high school. Who fucking gives a shit? I'm sorry. Yeah. Legacy? The yes, high school mom, legacy? Impact left on the student body. Graduation's only a few months away, you know. See, I'm glad you brought that up. I will literally never, never see any of these people again never. after graduation. There's no point in socially trying with anyone here. We must have someone you'd like to stay in touch Maybe with after Jacka. graduation. Nope. Not even your friend Jessica? Jessica's like, okay, but I'm not going out of my way to hang out with her. Isn't legacy for like a major career or something? Your high school <laughs> career. Oh, is That's this a career That's important. Now? What's my salary? A $2 lunch and 20 years of sexual harassment <laughs> trauma? Such pessimism at such a young age. When you're an adult, you learn how to No, you don't! Life. Oh, I'm sure there's tons of life to love. None of it having anything to do with this high school. Why would I care what some kid sitting two rows back from me thinks? It's not about right now. It's the tons of fun memories you can revel in years after college. Okay, um, I know you work here and employee culture keeps your checks signed, but... Anyone well into their 20s still thinking about how high school was is a fucking waste of TBH. space. TBH. Perhaps I should introduce you to some of our class of 87 alumni. Many of them are teachers here today. So they're the lower middle class of 87? No thanks. <laughs> so fuck photography. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, so that fucking bites! <laughs> we can take pictures with a camera phone. Who even needs a camera camera anymore? Exactly. Men who teach electives get so insecure when they realize they can't stop anyone from graduating. Bitch, be happy anyone even took the <laughs> class. It's an art course anyway, like doing your makeup's a huge step down. What's up, you God, horse? Kyler, wow. wow. Hi, Kyler. You shit-talking Mr. White? Yeah, he probably deserves it. What do you want? All right, damn. Did you guys get an invite to Kelly's pool party? It's October. No, her parents are, like, really rich. It's Glassman and everything. Yeah, and her pool stuff is sick. They got those four foot long syringe water gun things. What are you, 10? <laughs> Whatever. Just a little fun on the side while we'll picking up bitches. I've been here for a year and never once heard of someone having sex with you. I've been here since third grade and haven't heard of <laughs> -uh. Remember freshman year with Jenny Fillmore? She was unconscious. How do you still brag about that? You're like the reason they have women's college. <laughs> okay, old news, whatever. You have invites or not? Yeah, me too. How do you get one? You haven't even been here that I'm long. I'm hot. Because I have a nice face and I'm not fat. Okay, well, can I tag along with you guys? This weekend's gonna be so boring if I can't go. Why the fuck would we take you? I'm responsible for you ruining the party, but I also don't want to be responsible for you crashing it out of roid rage. Nicole's choice. Fuck off. Fine. Nicole, I know I called you a whore like two minutes ago, but could you let me go with you just this once? We don't fucking hang out with rapists. No, fuck off. Fine, be a bitch. See if I care. You're just mad you can't see us in bikinis this weekend. What are you doing? What? Don't get flustered like that. He's a rapist. Sex turns into violence overnight. Over a minute. What, like, over a minute. That and jerking off while thinking about us suddenly turning into Jekka would look so hot with her organs gouged out. <laughs> How do you know these things? I had a brother. Had. So what are you wearing to Kelly's pool party? Well, summer's over, so no more selling anything. Hello, girls. Going to a pool party in the fall? Yeah, well, I don't know, maybe. I can't find anything to wear for it. I could help you out with that. You sell bikinis? Of course not. But swing by my office later and we can take some measurements for the Home Ex Sewing Club. We'll make sure it fits flawlessly to your every curve. Gee, thanks. I'll see you there, maybe. Have a good day at school. <laughs> Did he just say your every curve? Yeah, is he allowed to say that? What are you guys freaking out about? I think the counselor might have made an advance at me. He literally asked you to go to his office, get naked, and be measured. Yawn, what else is new? What? You've gone here longer than me. How did you not notice? To be fair, he's kind of subtle about it. He's what I call a marathon pedophile. <laughs> Sorry, but... Marathon, a marathon pedophile. pedophile? 
He tries to make you question society's hatred of pedophilia before he actually molests you. Then you'll feel bad if you tell on him afterward. So he guilts you so he can make a routine out of it? Exactly. A predator that plays the long game. A marathon pedophile. That's like... It's I guess worst it's damn I true. He was gonna do. Why do you even want to measure you anyway? For a bikini to wear at Kelly's pool party? He'd have home ec make it. Home ec? What are they gonna make? A fucking felt bathing suit? I didn't say I was gonna do it. But yeah, I'd probably fall apart after a lap in the pool. A anyway. lap. Excuse me? You planned on swimming at a pool party? What do you do at a pool party? Sit around and look cute. Same. I mean, Karen could sit around and look cute. God damn it! Yay, still using more combination this locks. stuff. The school's soft. No one steals shit anyway. You still aren't dressed. Yeah, they need thumbprint scanners or some shit. It's 2008. Isn't it the future by now? You're gonna be late. No shit. Now, how many sins again? Nailed it. Wait, hey, what's up, how Jeff? There's no lock on the doors. Saw it as a great opportunity for an A plus in street photography. Did your cartoons tell you to yes. do this? Yes. Uh, it's anime. First anime off, tell you to get her right. Get a girl in public or something. Oh, Hold Nicole, on. If your brain. Oh, you just pause. Brain was as big as your ample breasts, then maybe you'd understand. Yeah. Okay. Side on Jeffrey. If you're gonna call me a fucking nerd. Yeah, there it is. There's my. If you're gonna call me a fucking nerd, at least have the public decency to get it right. All right. <laughs> call me my specific flavor of nerd. All right. It's just gonna fucking roll right past my fucking dumb nerd head if you just hey you fucking gamer or whatever. It's like uh uh I'm an otaku bra. I'm a brony bra. Fucking. Get it right, bitch. <laughs> I'm sorry, do you think you're cool right now? You're a freak, not even the sex fiend counselor. I'm sorry, do you think you're cool right now? You're a freak, not even the sex fiend counselor wants to Not even you. him. Your petty insults, cam girls. Oh, I'm not even clicking digital here. Digital nonsense. I have your petty insults. I'm sorry, do you think Oh, Nicole. If you're br I'm sorry, do you think you're cool right now? You're a freak. Your petty insults will make the development of this photograph all the more satisfying. Cam girls are all cheap digital nonsense. I have captured your succulent a medium, on format, medium film. format film. Every little shadow and highlight of your tantalizing midriff captured the way it was meant to be. If you're gonna sexually harass me, could you not talk like a cartoon character while you, you are do a it? cartoon character? I do what I want with my words. I'll also do as I please with this. That is photo. fucking creepy, no, come Jeff. On, just throw the film out. I'm afraid I can't do that. Every boy with a crush on you should pay top dollar for these prints. Or maybe I could hang a giant poster of it out front, humiliating you the way you've humiliated me time after time. What? Because I called you a future pedophile in chemistry last year? Kate, hey, sorry. Now throw it out. You won't convince me otherwise. Looks like we're dating Jeffrey. Huh. Wait, was I at the wrong locker? Every t It's always the wrong locker. I walked into the wrong Lock locker door. room Thanks, once with what the, the girls, and that right was now? embarrassing. Ruin my life. Well, I can't I fucked up. Again? Cause that's fucking embarrassing, Miss Lynn. That mean boy has a picture of my titties halfway out. Yeah, they'll probably find a way to make it your fault anyway. Yeah. I still can't believe he shot it on medium format film. Medium format film. Kind of film. Jerks off to film prints. Her parents in the seventies. Wait, like film, film, like it needs to be developed. Yeah, he said he was getting it developed at tomorrow's film club. Break in that bitch. No lab, no developing. If it's some weird format, there won't be another one for miles and miles, right? Destroying the dark room. Would I get expelled for that? If you go in after everybody leaves, no one needs to know. Just wear gloves or something so you don't leave fingerprints. Gloves? If I have any. Will you go with me? No, it's not my ass on film. Come on, I'd help if it was you. <laughs> no, you wouldn't. Okay, I wouldn't, but... <laughs> God damn it. Is it really the end of the world if people see you in your underwear? You look good naked. Yeah, exactly. If I had weird tits and a gut, it'd be classified as an artistic <sighs> nude. But if you're hot with no clothes on? It's porn. <sighs> Fine, I'll drive you over there, but I'm not stepping a foot inside that place. Let's go. Uh-oh. Wow, I am creative when it comes to destroying things. Are you done yet? Yeah, just about. This should buy me enough time to swipe Jeffrey's camera and ruin the negative. Hey! 
Do you have Whoa. permission to be here? Uh, if I said a teacher told me to meet here for a date, would you go after him or just blame me for that too? A date in your pajamas. Did he tell you to destroy thousands in school property too? Look at this place. Come with Who me. Who called what? the cops? It was like this when I sleepwalked in here. You wear gloves to bed? Well, so much for Jekka's stupid fucking glove Oops. idea. To this day, I genuinely believe sleepwalking would have worked if it wasn't for wearing those. Anyway, I got statewide expulsion. Yeah, I didn't know it was a thing either. Statewide? Mom refused to move again, forced me to get a shitty job, and hits me to relieve her feelings of disappointment. The deep fryer leaving craters on my face is bad, but anyone from school seeing me is a suicidal experience. Wow, the camera really does add 10 pounds. Fuck oh off. my. Oh. Shit. Where did it all go wrong? We were so close to graduating. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so fucking close. We almost made it. All right. I think that'll do it for this one. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one. This game's fucking great.